Ouch. Tell me, are you crazy? You kicked me. Leave my friends alone right now. Or there are more of them. I'm so sorry, Lisa. I won't do anything anymore, I promise. Lisa, what happened here? I've settled this once and for all. Clara won't cause you any more problems. I promise you that. Thank you, Lisa. You are my hero. Shall we go out for an ice cream? I invite you. Yes, I'd love to. Why not? What's up, Clara? Why are you crying? Mom, a classmate kicked me today. Did you do anything again? I'm sure it's your fault. Stop crying now. I don't have any friends, Mom. Everyone hates me. Have you played any pranks again? That happened at last school too. I just wanted to be Sarah's best friend. Of course, people hate you when you treat them that way. If you want to make friends, you have to be nice. As long as people are afraid of you, you'll never make friends. Dad, I have to confess something to you. What's up, Lisa? I kicked Clara today. She threatened Sarah. She then said that she would always keep going. I needed to do something about it. So I don't normally support violence. But in this case, you had to fight back. It's all good, darling. You've done nothing wrong. Now go to your room and get some rest. A new day starts again tomorrow. Thank you, Dad. You're the best. Hi, Clara. What do you want from me? Go away. I'd like to apologize to you, Sarah. Oh, now you're suddenly being nice or what? I know I've made mistakes. Please give me another chance. I'd like to be your girlfriend. You want to be my girlfriend? I think you're crazy. Lisa had to leave school because of you. I'll never be your girlfriend. I even baked you a cake, Sarah. You can throw it in the trash can. 
I'm sure there's something in it. That's another trick you did. No, I'm really serious this time. Leave me alone, Clara. I don't want anything to do with you. Hey Lara. How are you doing? Is everything okay with you, Lisa? I can't complain. Tell me is it true what they say to each other? What do you mean? The others were talking about you. They said you beat up Clara. Is that true? Yes, that is true. She's gone too far. She can do what she wants with me. But I want her to leave my friends alone. You're so cool, Lisa. Let's go in now. Classes start soon. Hello dear students. Wow, you're all on time. You did a great job. In return, each of you gets a one. I love this school. Sarah, Clara, what's going on here? Do you want to fight again? Sit down right away. Or you both get a six. I'm going to sit down. Mom, it didn't work. I was nice to the others. But it didn't do anything. No one wants to be friends with me. What is going on here? Clara, why are you crying? Oh my god, you have a black eye. How did that happen? A classmate kicked her. Because she's played some pranks again. And you're just standing here doing nothing? What is wrong with you, Steffi? Someone hit our daughter. We must do something about it. Come along, Clara. We'll sort it out. Where are we going, Dad? To the girl who hit you. Do you know where this Lisa lives? She lives at Maxtras 25. Then we'll go there. Is that really necessary, Dad? Yes, definitely. No one does that to my daughter. Lisa will see. Everything has consequences. Who are you and what are you doing in my house? Clara, is that the girl who hit you? 
Yes, Dad. That is it. That's Lisa. How dare you hit my daughter? Do you have any idea what Clara has done? Because of her, Lisa received two referrals and had to leave school. That's no reason to hit or kick them. I think you've misunderstood something there. Lisa is the victim here, not Clara. So I only see a child with a black eye. And that's not Lisa. What are you really doing here? Just say it and then leave. Actually, I just wanted an apology from Lisa. For kicking Clara. But I've changed my mind. We're going to show Lisa. We will report them for physical injury. My best friend is a lawyer. He'll sort it out. So that her daughter learns that you don't do things like that. Come on, Clara. We're going. Okay, Dad. Honey, I got a letter for us. It's from a lawyer. Let me have a look. What? You can't be serious about that. Clara's family wants compensation. Because Lisa kicked her? How much do they want? It says they want 10,000 euros. Oh my God, what are we supposed to do now? We don't have that much money. I don't know, darling. We also can't afford a lawyer. I've got an idea. Hello, Mr. Peters. It's Mr. Polnikova. Hello, Mr. Polnikova. I'm sorry, but I don't have time right now. I've got a big problem. Wait. I'd like to help you. Sarah told me what happened. You need a good lawyer? I've got someone for you. His name is Harold Hubracht. He has worked for our family for a long time. He is the best lawyer I know. That would really help a lot. Because we can't afford a lawyer? Thank you, Mr. Polnikova. What can I give you in return? Let's say you owe me a favor. I'm going to need your help sometime. Then I must be able to count on you. You can do that. Thank you, Mr. Polnikova.
The court is meeting today in the Lisa v. Clara case. It concerns a bodily injury and a claim of 10,000 euros in compensation. What does the defense have to say about this? This is clearly statement against statement. There is no evidence that my client kicked Mrs. Clara Huber. No one saw the crime. There is also no video. She could have kicked herself. And then blame my mandate. Mrs. Clara Huber has a long history of lies and intrigue. There is no reason to believe her. What are you pleading for, Mr. Hubracht? Due to the lack of evidence, we plead for acquittal. The court has analyzed the situation. Since there is no evidence, the defendant is acquitted. Lisa Peters does not have to pay compensation. How do I pay you now? Mr. Polnikova has already paid me. Soon you'll have to do something for him? We will geld must Lisa's family zollen? A. 0 euros. B. 5,000 euros. C. 10.000 euros. Schreibinen Kommentar.